Welcome to the construction of the future podcast Matrix Structures. We will delve into the latest and greatest advancements in the construction industry. Today, we're going to be discussing the topic of what are modern methods of construction. As we enter a new era of building, it's essential to understand the innovative techniques and technologies that are transforming the way we build. But before we start, simply please go to the subscribe button. This will ensure that you receive notifications whenever we post new content. Another way to show your support and help us grow is by liking our videos. This not only helps us understand what content resonates with our audience, but it also helps us reach a larger audience on YouTube. So don't be shy, give our videos a like and share them with your friends and colleagues. Thank you. What are modern methods of construction? Our first method is 3D volumetric construction. This is a revolutionary technique that involves constructing building components off-site in a controlled factory environment using 3D technology. This process allows for precise and efficient construction with minimal waste and reduced time on site. The components are then transported to the construction site and assembled on site to form the final structure. This method is particularly useful for constructing complex building shapes and structures. Next up, we have flat slabs. This is a type of concrete flooring system that uses a flat reinforced concrete slab instead of beams and columns to support the weight of the building. This method results in a simpler and more efficient construction process, as well as a more aesthetically pleasing interior design. Thirdly, we have timber frames. Timber frames are a traditional method of construction that has been revitalized with modern technology. This method involves constructing the frame of the building using engineered timber, which is a sustainable and environmentally friendly material. The use of timber frames results in a faster and more cost-effective construction process, as well as improved thermal performance. Another modern method of construction is the use of precast panels. This technique involves manufacturing building components, such as walls and floors, off-site in a controlled factory environment. The panels are then transported to the construction site and assembled on site to form the final structure. This method results in a faster construction process with improved quality control and reduced waste. We also have concrete walls and floors. This is a traditional method of construction that has been enhanced with modern techniques and technologies. The use of concrete in construction provides strength, durability, and fire resistance, making it a popular choice for construction. The use of advanced technologies such as 3D printing and BIM, building information modeling, has also improved the construction process for concrete walls and floors. Another method of construction is the use of precast foundations. This technique involves manufacturing the foundation elements, such as piles and beams, off-site in a controlled factory environment. The precast foundation elements are then transported to the construction site and assembled on-site to form the final structure. This method results in a faster construction process with improved quality control and reduced waste. Finally, we have twin wall technology. This method involves constructing the walls of the building using two layers of reinforced concrete panels. The space between the two panels is filled with insulation, providing improved thermal performance and reducing the need for heating and cooling. This method results in a faster construction process with improved energy efficiency and reduced waste. Last but not least, we have thin joint masonry. This is a modern method of constructing walls using masonry units, such as bricks or blocks, with thin mortar joints. This method results in a faster and more efficient construction process with improved thermal performance and reduced waste. If you would like more information about matrix structures, then take a look at our website matrixstructures.com. That's all for today's episode. Thank you for listening and make sure to subscribe and like our YouTube channel for even more amazing content. Join us next time for more discussions.